What is up, Tarver Academy Sword Horses? We got a beautiful day to learn some math, don't we? Don't we? Hit that subscribe button. We're about to learn something, everything, just not everything, just something. Okay, how many diagonals does a heptagon have? All right, pause it, give it a shot, and then we'll work it together. Ready? And here we go. Okay, so first off, you need to know what is a heptagon, okay? So you know triangle's three, quadrilateral is four, pentagon is five, hexagon is six, because they both have X's in it, and then a heptagon is seven. So you need to draw a seven-sided figure. So like one, oh, we need to make it bigger. Let's do um, one, two, oh goodness, I'm not good at drawing heptagons. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Maybe that's, that's good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is the ugliest heptagon of all time. I'm so sorry. Um, okay, so hopefully you drew a heptagon. If not, you've got one on your paper now. So we want to figure out the diagonals of it, okay? Just to refresh you on what a diagonal is, most of you guys are thinking of like word searches, like, oh, you've got horizontal, you've got vertical, and then diagonal goes like this. And that's pretty much exactly correct. Um, if you've got a rectangle, um, diagonals go from coordinates that essentially won't fall on a line of it. So, for instance, <clears throat> I'm so sorry, um, you're wanting to go from an angle to every other angle that you can. I can't go here to here and make it a diagonal, why not? Because when I do that, I'm falling on the side of the rectangle. I can't go here to here. It falls on the side of the rectangle. If it falls on the side of it, like because they're adjacent angles, then it's not a diagonal. It has to touch every angle outside of it. Okay? So here's what you do. Pretty much you just start at one point and start connecting all the diagonals and you work your way all the way around. Because they'll overlap. So you don't want to just do the same thing to everybody or you're going to get like way too many diagonals. So let's start here. Okay? <clears throat> so sorry. So we can't go there because that's not a diagonal. That's on the line of the heptagon. So I'm going to go to the next one. One. Go to the next one. Two. Go to the next one. Three. Go to the next one. Four. Can I do this one? No, I can't. So I'm going to put this. That's four at that one. Let's go to the next angle. Can't go there because that's a line on the heptagon. I'm going to go here. One. Two. Three, four. You can't go there because it's a line of the heptagon. So I did four there. They're going to get less and less because I'm, I'm already making it. So like right here, I can't make that line because I've already made it. It doesn't count. There would be two diagonals. They can't overlap. So start here. Can't go to this one. I'm systematically working my way around for each of these so I don't miss any. That's a line of the heptagon. Can't do it. Already done that diagonal. Can't do it. I can do this one. One, two, three, and that would fall on the line, so I can't do it. So three. Same thing here. Can't do it. It's part of the heptagon. Um, this is a poorly drawn line, but this one already has a diagonal. Already has a diagonal. This one doesn't. One, two. So we got two there. All right, let's go here. <clears throat> let's work our way around. That's can't do it. It's on the line. Can't do Already done it. Already done it. Already done it. Haven't done this one. One. And can't do it. It's on the side. So let's try this one. Start over here, on the line, can't do it. Already done it, already done it, already done it, already done it, can't do it. So zero, and then here, these are already done. Line, done, 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 line. Okay, I checked those, even though I knew that last one, like I was fairly certain, I might have missed one, might have overlapped, but like I might have messed up, so I wanted to check it. So let's add these up, four, plus four is eight, plus three is 11, plus two is 13, plus one is 14. So let's check our question. How many diagonals does a heptagon have? 14 is your answer. You got it. You did great. Hey, it's like I always say, you're not bad at math. You're always improving. Okay, this is Tyler Tarver County. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day. Check in for more. Peace. Tell your friends. Tell your friends, yeah? Yeah, yeet.